Take a look, folks. First glance at the river. From way up top, we stand. And wow, it is just a gorgeous day out. And the flows are awesome, guys. I think we're gonna go down here and try to catch a fish. Well, folks, myself and the taco have made it out to a beautiful little fishing destination. Guys, doing some traveling and fishing today um, out in just this beautiful Targi National Forest. And uh, we got a river running right through this canyon here. And it's just looking like some good fishing. I've seen some bugs crawling around already. Uh, possibly salmon flies, caddis, um, and then your baitis. Like blue wing olive and stuff. If you guys don't fly fish, this is all foreign to you. But if not, I'll show you an example when we get down there if I can see some. Uh, but I'm going to throw on the waders here and get out because it's too nice. As you can see here, bear spray ready for duty too. In case we get a grizz, so let's do it. I'm excited. is a salmon fly right there. That's an imitation salmon fly, of course. And we're gonna be going with below that, a salmon fly nymph as well. The two, those two flies there, see if they'll get us something. If not, we got a very plenty options of other possible flies that we can go through. Looks to be like a good path down here. Awesome, let's do it. Wow. Look at this, guys. Made it to the river. And this is looking as good as it's gonna get right here. Awesome. Man, it's fun throwing big flies like this. Including if a fish will actually come up and eat it. This could be a good time. So guys, you see this little white fly? Two of them, three of them, four of them, look at them all. All those that are flying around, they look drunk. Those are caddis. Um, so those are basically, not exactly what I'm using. Maybe I should put on a caddis after seeing how many are over here. Um, but that is one form of fly that trout absolutely love. Look at him jumping all over. But we're gonna keep going up here. We're gonna try this setup for now. And if nothing, we'll switch here in a minute. There we go, guys. Oh, come on, buddy. He's running right at us. Oh, about time. Oh, that's a big, that's a nice fish. Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. About time, guys. I have been fishing for far too long with no fish here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. See if we can get them in here. Man, these rainbows in this beautiful canyon, just so strong. All right, buddy. Not even a giant fish, but man, he's strong and he is healthy. Look at that. Got him. Oh, got him. Awesome. Look at that big fat rainbow. Wow. Well, there he goes, guys. Not the best release, but nonetheless, he didn't even come out of the water for more than 10 seconds there. Man, that feels good to get the first fish. 
check that out guys. Look at that salmon fly compared to the one we got. How cool is that? Shows you they're out. I'm just doing some stunting right here from log to log here. And this guy came coming out. So we're gonna let him go right back in the wild. Wow, cool. So it's cool to see they're out here. That's the first one I've truly seen on the bank. Haven't seen any on the water yet. So I wouldn't doubt a couple more weeks and they'll be in full force, but oh, just trying to find some fish for you guys. I've been grinding pretty hard, so we'll keep hunting. Well guys, other than that one rainbow, um, not quite much has been going on. So we are gonna go possibly try one more spot before it's low light. Uh, but as you can see, it's just gorgeous out. Wow, surprised we haven't come across any like mushrooms or anything yet uh, to forage as well, but having a good time. So let's go ahead and get out into another spot and see if we can find some more fish before we go to camp here. Spot number two. And oh my gosh, there's fish jumping out there already. This is awesome. Well guys, round two. We got a bunch of fish out here rising. This water is just absolutely gorgeous. Oh! There we go guys, got him. Got them right on the bank. Oh, that was so sick. I can't believe we got on the rise. Wow. As you saw, there were multiple fish rising over there. And sure enough, we got one to come up and they looked a lot bigger. There were bigger fish over there, but I'm very content with that fish. That's so fun. So fun doing that type of fishing. Casting right into the banks and waiting for one to come up and sip. Thanks, buddy, you made my day. Oh, there he goes. See ya. Didn't get to see the camera, but however, there's more eating over there. So let's see if we can go back and get one more before we head out. There we go, got a bigger fish, bigger fish, guys. Oh, oh yeah, baby, oh yeah. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Same spot right on the bank. Can't believe that. Oh, that was so sick. Wow. Oh my gosh, beautiful fish. Come on, buddy, I gotta show you to the camera. Better fish. That was a much better fish. Oh, all right, relax. Here's our culprit right there. Absolutely beautiful rainbow trout. So blessed. Last look at that beautiful fish. Thanks, girl. I'm not gonna mess with you no longer. Here you go. Back to home. Wow. Oh, <laughs> just. As you, just right here, right off the bank. They're in about a couple inches of water coming up and eating these calabate, excuse me, uh, blue wing olives, betis, right on the surface. And sure enough, I got a perfect cast and that fish came right out of its feeding lane, came up and ate our fly. Oh, that's so sick, guys. Look at this canyon we sit in. Just absolutely magnificent. Oh, so fun. It's on that note. I think we're going to get on out of here. GoPro doesn't see much and nor do you guys on the phone. So uh, we're going to go ahead and get this fly all tucked back into place here and 
go ahead and find a camp for the night if we don't camp right here. So this is a pretty sweet little spot. Tell you what, it's pretty berry out here. I'm uh, fully aware, the mosquitoes are out already too, it's crazy. Fully aware of the bear situation out here. It's pretty insane, uh, I'm including with, there's really no control of them, so they keep populating like crazy. It's cool to see grizzlies return, but it's definitely a little scarier when you're out in the area. Black bear's not so scary, but grizzlies, um, yeah, they, they scare me a little bit, so anyways. If you can't tell, I'm definitely, I'm always got my eye out just wandering. And I'm sure, you know, knock on wood, running into one, it's probably still pretty rare. As running into any bear. Um, but the fact that they're here is quite creepy. So, <laughs> guys, I'm going to get everything off here and I'll see you in the camper. All right, guys, home sweet home. Sweet little crib for the night. We're gonna go ahead and do something easy for dinner night. It's been a long day. Good old pasta Alfredo. A little special technique from the uh, Sierra Trading Post. These things are four bucks a pop, so saves you quite a bit of money when you need to stock up on a bunch of frozen food. So, excuse me, dehydrated. So, that's the strap there. Jet boil and some water to get that boiling. Let's go ahead and get it going. It is howling out right now. The wind is picking up like crazy. So, hopefully it don't shake the taco too much. Mother trucker. Ooh, hot mother trucker. Well, guys, I'll see you in about 12 to 15 minutes, so wait this one out. Ooh, smells and looks delicious. It is boiling hot still. Look at that. Chicken Alfredo. Cheers. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Mmm. Perfect. Well, guys, I'm going to enjoy the rest of this. Absolutely phenomenal dinner, quick and easy. Uh, thanks so much for tuning in. Make sure to click that like button, guys, and stay tuned for the next one where I'm going to wake up in the morning, fish somewhere new, travel somewhere new, camp somewhere new, and have a good time. So, anyways, guys, watch the other videos that I have linked in above. I'll see you in the next one.